so we have a situation. The weather got really bad last night. It's currently, what time is it? 11 a.m.? 12. 12 a.m. And we'll show you on the map. It is how many hours drive? Six hours drive? Um, it's not much different time-wise, I know that. But because of the weather that's not improved roads, it's not looking good to drive. So we're making the decision whether we have to drive or take this ferry. We just found the ferry. We're trying to find out the times if we can make the ferry because driving would probably be very treacherous at this point because of the storm. One of those things God did. Seven days. Hello. Yeah, hello, how are you? I'm great, how are you? Very <laughs> good. Uh, I've got a house booked uh, tonight. Um, through bungalow.com in the uh, West West Fjords, and I just wanted to check in, uh, I guess, for information on check-in. Yes, that's great. Uh, do you know where we are? Uh, I've got the GPS coordinates, so I'm going to go to right. that. That's quite easy. You, when you come to our area, you will leave the main road, and you will go to a gate. And I'm, I'm in the first house on your right. Okay, and uh, that will be next to the house we're staying in? Yeah, like 30 meters away. I have another question for you. Um, our group has expanded a little bit, and I was wondering if you happen to have an available second house we could rent near this one. I think everything in the surroundings is occupied. Okay. How many are you? We have eight. We have eight. Should we also buy groceries before coming in? I assume there's not much in the area. Where are you now? We are in uh, Grundefjord. Yes. Uh, will you be taking the ferry? I think so. Do I need to book that or can you just yeah, show up? I would. Okay. I actually would. All right. And I would do the shopping and bonus and stick it on the which is the town that the ferry departs from. Okay, so the town, all right, excellent. It's Okay, that works. They have one room six kilometers away from you. Okay. That could work for you. So now nah, we'll just we'll figure it out. I think we can we'll, we'll manage. We're a resilient group. Okay, that, that sounds good. Well, uh, you said you're the first house off the road through the gate? Through the gate, first house on your right. Excellent. And your name? Perfect. We will, uh, we'll see you this afternoon. Perfect. <clears throat> Do you know what time the ferry leaves? I think it's past up to... Let me see. Yeah, this may determine whether or not we're going to take the ferry. <laughs> Excellent. That sounds awesome. So you will arrive here at 7 o'clock. Perfect. That sounds good. It is good. I will, we will see you this afternoon. All right. All right, cheers. Bye bye. It is good. Fucking Icelandic. Dude, Icelandic people like, are just the best. He goes, he goes what are those kids with put them outside? He's like, of yes. course. <laughs> <laughs> you can't fucking stun an Icelander. With four beds and two couches, do you think we'll be fine, right? We're relatively in this situation again. Yeah. 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 We'll be fine. Yeah. Great idea. Yeah. All right. Because right. otherwise time passes here at a fucking rate. So we yeah. pretty much have three hours, right? We need to just get ready and go. Get, yeah, we should probably just get and go to the town. Half hour. An hour is perfect. I think so I'm it's 12.30 if we're out of here at 1.30.
Which is more realistic. Yeah. Uh, I might shower. Go shower. The water's hot. I don't want to like take up the bathroom if anyone needs it. I've, I've pooped already. So the decision's been made based off the weather and the ferry availability that we are going to go on the ferry, which is cool because that means we don't have to drive six to infinite hours of what mm -hmm. potentially could happen on that route. I feel like we made a good decision. Yeah. As long as the ferry doesn't sink. There's only one ferry. There's only one ferry. I don't know. That's the problem. I just use my phone now. So apart from the ferry sinking, we're in good shape. On any trip you take, on any adventure that you try to go on, you really can't plan it. Not if you really want to have the adventure that's gonna make lifelong memories. I'm really glad that, that we got to a place that we weren't planning what we will do and instead seeing what we could do. And by doing so, we're now taking the time to enjoy the little things that this trip has to offer. And I think this is really where it's gonna turn around and make a trip of a lifetime. We can work so hard and we can work so fast and we can work right through our lives. But if we don't take a little bit of time, stop, look up and get in our hands dirty, we're gonna miss the whole thing.